to find and film Patagonia's wildlife. The team relied on local experts, guides, and trackers. One scientist in particular took the crews to the most remote locations in search of creatures they'd never have found on their own. They call him the bug detective, entomologist extraordinaire Isai Madris. I specialize in going to areas of the world where no one has ever been, and I look for rare and new species of insects. The challenge for director Kate Laurie is keeping up with him. Isai is not your average scientist. He's out in the field as much as he possibly can be. He'll climb to the top of tree canopies, pack raft down rivers, hike glaciers. Because he wants to immerse himself in the bug's environment. He's dedicated. This time, Isai is leading the crew into the heart of Chile's Valdivian forest. The mission is to find a primitive crane fly. It's going to be one of the prettiest insects you've ever seen. That means rigging a light trap high up in the canopy. And where Isai goes, Elijah must follow. So the ropes team is rigging up my camera with some security lines. Taking expensive equipment up into the canopy is never something you can not worry about. Operating from anything moving is obviously difficult. Um, there's a lot of variables. <sighs> With the trap set, Isai begins making his bed. He insists on sleeping in the trees so he can check the trap at dawn. So how often do you camp out? All the time. I started when I went to university and I couldn't afford housing. Hmm. So I just pitch a hammock up in the trees and nice. I slept there. I like it. It's really calm and it gives you a different perspective mm. on the world, you know? Definitely does. As the sun rises over the canopy, Isai is already at work in his improvised field lab. So exciting. And he's got what he came here for. It's really, really cool. It's like a tiny dragon. 